Hey YouTube, I have been talking to myself for the last, um, I don't know, like five minutes, thinking that I'm recording, but <laughs> anywho. Hi YouTube! Mwah! Love, love, love. I'm sending love, love in the universe. Anywho, um, I don't know if you noticed the title of this, but it is called Negus. 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 Embrace that word. Negus. I was watching Brother Hakeem Green. Very profound brother. And uh, I found out some truth about the word Negus. 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 Embrace that word. King of kings, baby. Nah, me. I. Anywho. Um, so I'm, I'm embracing the energy associated with negus, negro, niggers. It's, it's really a positive word. It's a good energy. So, and I'm going to read in the dictionary. This dictionary, by the way, was given to me when I graduated from high school in 1983 by my mommy. So I'm going to read some words to you. We're going to start with Negro. Yes, let's start with Negro. We're gonna start with that word, and we're gonna we're gonna end with niggas. We're gonna end with niggas, but we're gonna start with Negro. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Here we go. And I gotta give you some dates also because um I think the dates are important as well. Anyway, okay. Negro. My bifocals fell off, you know. I need my eyes. I need my second set of eyes. I ain't all raw yet, so it, it hasn't... First of all, you gotta be raw and organic. And organic is... I'm working on it. <laughs> I'm gonna put positive words in the universe. I'm working on it. All organic and raw. Okay, Negro. 1555. A member of the black race of mankind distinguished from members of other races by usually inherited physical and psychological characteristics without regards to language or culture. A member of people belonging to the African branch of the black race. A person of Negro descent. That's Negro. Okay. Negrophil. One who is especially friendly to Negroes and their interests. Negrophil. Negrophobe. Which we should classify George Zimberman. Negrophobe. One who is one who strongly dislikes or fears Negroes. George Zimmerman. Okay, now here comes the word we must embrace, which is the root word of all of that I just uh, went through. Negus. Negus. N-E-G-U-S. Negus. King of Kings. It says 1594. I don't get that because that word was created much earlier than them but it, it, anyway it says used as a title of the sovereign of Ethiopia king and then it says negus is a second definition it's also a beverage of wine hot water water hot water sugar and lemon juice and spice okay now let's go to the word niggas which once again is a derivative of negus N-E-G-U-S. Embrace it, y'all. King of kings, I'm trying to tell you. I am what I am is what I am. Okay. Now I have a whole new respect for the word niggas. Niggas. N-E-G-U-S. Okay, now we get into niggers, N-I-G-G-E-R. 
nigger, negro, usually taken to be offensive. Okay, negro, black. A member of the dark-skinned race, usually taken to be offensive. A member of a socially disadvantaged class of people. It's time for somebody to lead all of American niggas and the people who feel left out of the political progress. Ron Dellums. Now, why am I doing this on niggas? I'm doing it on negus because I am a firm believer of power versus force. And every energy, every word has an energy. And every energy associated with that word is its truth. With that being the case, negus, which is the root word of nigger, where it all stemmed from, if it means king of kings, if it means a king, a sovereign of the Ethiopian, it is a profound truth. So, we must embrace our truth and appreciate where we come from and who we are. So, love thyself, know thyself, and love thyself. I think it's imperative. Well, I know it is. One love, y'all. Peace. I am Willette. And I'm out.